Hi, my name is Lena Sergidas, and I'd like to talk to you about my plan to help reduce child mortality. One of the biggest killers of children in the developing world is malaria. Cerebral malaria is a severe complication of malaria infection that mostly affects young children. Even when treated with the best anti-malarial drugs, one in five children with cerebral malaria will die, and of the survivors, one in four would be left with long-term learning and memory impairment. We currently have no way to treat cerebral malaria. I have spent the last 15 years of my life researching ways to treat cerebral malaria, and I think I have found a treatment that may work, a class of drugs called PPAR gamma agonists. First, let me explain what happens in cerebral malaria. Malaria parasites infect our red blood cells and make the cells sticky. Cerebral malaria occurs when the malaria parasites stick in the brain and our body's immune system tries to fight them, but in so doing causes damage to the brain. From my experiments, I believe we can avoid much of the damage to the brain by simply tweaking the immune system so that although it still fights the parasite, it is kept under control so it does not damage the brain. PPAR gamma agonists can exert just this kind of control over the immune system. In addition, PPAR gamma agonists have been shown to protect the brain from damage and to help the brain heal itself. PPAR gamma agonists could be very effective in treating cerebral malaria, and I'm hoping to be able to test these drugs in patients. I hope you liked what you've heard. Please help me to obtain the funding to test this very promising treatment by clicking on the thumbs up button. I really do think that PPAR gamma agonists have the potential to help in the fight against cerebral malaria and in reducing child mortality.